dozen heroines of all ages. When the world tells you to get a life, you're always welcome at the 1UP block. My name is Dan the Man, your host, and today we're going to be playing Castlevania. One of the most notoriously hard games of the NES era. Um, I have not beaten this particular... Hold on. Sorry, I couldn't talk over the opening. Um, I have not beaten this particular game. Uh, I've beaten a couple of the other games in the series. Uh, Castlevania... I can't remember the names. Dawn of Sorrow, Area of Sorrow, Portrait of Ruin, all those. I beat those on the DS and stuff. Those are the, uh, what everybody calls the Metroidvania games, where it's more RPG-based than it is skill-based. Uh where you can, you know, grind out your levels and to beat a boss, but, you know, there's there's fun to be had there if you like beating the crap out of stuff because you're stronger. I mean, I certainly do. It, it feels fun. It's like, it's kind of like, I don't know, it's fun to play. I wouldn't say it's challenging because I beat them all pretty easily once you get, you know, a good weapon and whatnot, but this, this game is based almost solely on, uh, your own wit and your own skill because uh, while some bosses can be outsmarted uh, I think I know how to out you're gonna see me outsmart some of them because I know how to I believe but uh, you have to use your wit and your skills to defeat this game because there's no oh I'm gonna go grind these enemies to become a little stronger you know there's none of that this this is platforming adventure game at its best and uh, I'm pretty sure it's gonna show <laughs> Um, I did a recording of this already, and I, I, I did it, and the volume on the, uh, music was, son of a bitch, the, vi the, blah, the audio of the music was so low that I, I restarted it, and it was such a shame, I, uh, son of a bitch, there was some wall meat there, <laughs> uh, it was such a shame, I got all the way, I beat the mummies, like, that's how far I got in the first episode, and I was so proud of myself, but, um, I did. There, there was barely any music in the background, and I didn't want that. If you're gonna, if I'm gonna play Castlevania, you guys are gonna listen to the music with me. I don't know why that pops up there. Is it one of those secret score things? Yep, that's exactly what it is. Some places in this game you can, uh, you can break a piece of wall, and if there's nothing there, it summons. Um, oh, I just used the clock. <laughs> it summons a uh, special. Uh, extra point power up thing. It does absolutely nothing but give you extra points, which is basically useless. I mean, the points do give you a one up and whatever, but you know, it's besides that, it's completely stupid. Um, you have unlimited continues. Son of a bitch! I didn't even mean to fall there. You have unlimited continues. I'm doing poorly right now. You have unlimited continues, so getting more lives is practically useless. But, uh, you know, whatever. The game wants to be that way, that's cool. Here we come to our first boss. Um, I didn't say this at the beginning, but those hearts are ammo. Uh, for which... What the fuck? Okay. Eh. Alright, I was trying to use... Uh, I don't know what the two does, apparently. Oh, shit, I'm about to die. I'm about to die, I'm about to die, I'm about to die. I'm about to die! Oh! I'm about to die. Kill it. Yes! <laughs> that was so close. Um, uh, I don't know what the two does. I tried to use it, but it didn't work. But whatever. Um, I recently watched John and Aaron play this on Game Grumps, and I've always wanted to let's play this, but I haven't done it yet. So, I mean, it looks like it looks like it'll be a relatively quick let's play. So uh, I figured I'd start it up. It'll it'll be ended. It'll end before I finish playing Pokemon or Zelda for sure. Um, but this game is really hard, so once I get past the mummies, I have no idea where it's going to go. And there's another one of those super point things. Completely useless. <coughs> Got your bat. And we're done with this one. Uh, but yeah. Oh, son of a bitch, did not mean to throw that. Um, you might, you need to conserve hearts for boss fights and whatnot. Uh, this one... What the fudge? 
didn't even know that was there. Uh, this boss fight, I think maybe you need to. Um, it's Medusa. She's kind of annoying, but she's really... She's not the hardest boss in this game, you know what I'm saying? Kind of like the bat. I mean, all you gotta do is throw shit at her and hit her with the whip and she's practically dead, so... You know. Um, I'm assuming this, uh, cross is for the Medusas, but... You don't really need it. They're pretty easy to handle. No! I did not want that, however. That sucks. Eh, whatever. I'm, I'm Gucci. Eh, I'll live. Uh, in the last recording, this place screwed me over a lot. I guess you can see why. Medusas suck. Eh, alright. I did not have to worry about the Medusas this time, though, because I've kind of mastered this area. Sucks. It was kind of funny when I died in the last recording. <laughs> I'm gonna miss that recording. I'm. It was, it was a really good one. Um, seems there's not going to be as much raging in this one because I'm actually doing pretty good so far. Whoa, he didn't even hit me. There is wall meat here. <laughs> Alright, so now we got to be careful because this... I know as soon as I get off this, there's going to be a Medusa, so I'm going to take off. Go! Ha! Yeah! See? There's not going to be any raging this time around. I think I just got another life. Yeah, I did. That's odd. But alright, here comes a hard part. Because this thing right here is an instant kill. So if you're not fast enough, oh, you're going to die. Man. Gives me a heart attack every time. Sometimes when I go back for that, uh heart I, I still like die it sucks but uh there's another two here <sighs> did I lose the other two what the hell happened I don't, what happened I don't even remember but um yeah see the game introduces these dragons right here and you're completely out of their reach when you first reach them so the game teaches you what they do without you being in their way you know like Aaron said on uh, Sequelitis. If you haven't noticed, I'm a big fan of Ego Raptor and Jontron. I'm just going to point that out right now. So if I ever imitate anything that they do, it's not because I'm trying to steal what they do. It's because I support them. <laughs> you know, I, I watch their crap. A lot of their views are probably me. So, you know. Alright, so here's the second boss. Medusa. Who basically does nothing but throw shit at you. And I do nothing but throw shit back! Shit. Yes! See, she's not that bad. Even though she totally, like... She caught me in a loop. She didn't really do anything that terrible. She's kind of easy, I think. Now I have a whole bunch of hearts left over because I didn't use any. Maybe I'll get an extra life. Nope. No. Alright, moving on to the next section, which is the mummies. Ah, oh, sorry, I took a, took a drink. I don't even get to keep my hearts from the last round. Well, I guess that would be kind of OP, wouldn't it? Oh, son of a bitch. The funny thing about these apes, though, is that, uh... See right here, they're they're introducing the apes. They're really fucking annoying. They're not apes, they're flea men or hunchbacks, but uh they're really fucking annoying, but there's a wall meat right here for you to, you know, get your health back just in case they you didn't figure out their patterns fast enough and you took a a I'm, I'm not gonna say that. Um that you took a beating from them, you know. Ugh, don't go down the stairs. But uh this place I hate the most because of these stupid not the skeleton. Skeleton's funny. He's like, Hey guys, I'm gonna throw you a party! <laughs> but no, the crows. The crows suck here. Alright, we're good. Um, I guess this isn't that bad. Is there some wall shit there? No. Okay, good. And this is where we use the holy water! <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. You have to outsmart the game here. 
and I like it. I really like this game. It's really fun. And uh, so far, I'm doing actually better than my first recording. I might. Well, I'm probably not even. I'm not gonna make it far enough to do the uh, the underwater level, but I'll definitely beat the mummies. Do 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 do. Oh, I tried to. Uh, son of a. Oh no! He's gonna come back, isn't he? Oh, he's still gone. Good. It. Oh no! No oh, fuck! See, that's what I hate. That's when the game cheats you out like that, but. You know, whatever. Alright, this is gonna be especially helpful here because I hate these stupid dragons. Ha <laughs> ha! Stopwatch beats all! Um, and, well, for the most part, I don't need any weapons to beat the mummies because they're really easy when you figure out what to do to them, so. I'm just going to use a stopwatch to get past here. I'm almost positive the stopwatch is meant to help you get through this part. Because those things suck dick. They just do. Like, I know there's a there's a way for you to um to hit their bullets and break the bullets. And that's how you're supposed to deal with them, but like I can never get it down right. I always get my timing off and it never freaking works, but uh, that's why I just use a stopwatch and cheat them out. See? I almost got hit right there! So shitty. Alright, you can't time stop the mummy, so, you know, I don't even need that shit, so. Get on the other side. I need to get on the other side of them. Alright. <sighs> come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Damn it! <laughs> so, yeah, that's their pattern. If you can get on the other side of them and you dip down and attack them, son of a bitch. <sighs> get the fuck out of here, crow. <sighs> See, now I'm going to screw up. I no longer have the upper hand. This is so crappy! Ah. Alright. What? Seriously? Oh man. This is this is oh no! This is going terrible. See, this is where the rage starts happening, because it's not it's so crappy. And then I gotta deal with... I'm dead. I'm dead. Just kill me. Just kill me. <laughs> this is gonna be awful. So, yeah. I made up for how awesome I did in the first recording by being shitty towards the end of this one. Uh, man, I, I beat the mummies on my first try for the first time in the first recording. And now look at this crap. I'm reduced. Oh my god, fuck those crows, dude. They're so erratic. I don't have a long enough whip to stop them. Oh my god, good! Good, turn around! I am so gonna die. There's no way. There's no freaking way. Oh, I might get him. I might get him. No, they got me cornered. <sighs> Son of a bitch! <laughs> this is not cool, dude. <sighs> Fucking crow. Oh my god, what the fuck was that? No. You're not getting the best on me, game. I beat you without even... S fuck you. Seriously. Stupid fucking crows. Alright. Are you serious? Are you fucking kidding me right now? Fuck you, crow. Crows are evil. 
<sighs> good. Good. Good! Good, I'm in the same damn boat as I was a few seconds ago. That last one is always the one that does me in, dude. Can I get a longer whip? See, it's when you get him caught like this. <sighs> now I can't win. Wait. Yes! I did it! <laughs> Alright, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, I did it. Well, I didn't do it at the 15 minute mark, but, uh, you know. <laughs> you got some rage there at the end of the episode, so I'm glad that happened. But, uh, I'm gonna wait for this transition, but, uh, you know. We're going to continue tackling Dracula's castle in the next episode, so I do hope... <laughs> Simon is dead. May he rest in peace. <laughs> Alright, ladies and gentlemen, join me again next time as we continue to tackle Dracula's castle. Maybe we'll continue to tackle Dracula's castle. Alright, let's see if we can continue with this streak and go and finish this in like three episodes. Alright, later days, guys.